Hi everyone, welcome back to another delicious recipe. Today we are making Cajun chicken over rice with this amazing creamy sauce. Absolutely delicious, especially when you in a hurry. So let's not waste no time, let's dive into this recipe. To begin, we have about three bone-in chicken thighs here. Skin on, bone in. We're going to drizzle, a, well, make sure you pat it dry first. So let's pat this dry. It's nice and pat dry and then uh, we're going to season. Now, if there's any fat on here, make sure to trim them off. We don't want the rice to be oily. So once you're done patting it dry, you're going to drizzle a little bit of olive oil, rub that in, flip over and drizzle some more, not a lot. Rub it in just like this. Now we're ready to season. So to season it, I'm using a little bit of salt, lemon pepper, onion powder, ground black pepper, and some dry parsley. Also, I'm going to be using my Cajun Crush today. I'm going to leave the website down below. You can use this on chicken, pork, fish, beef, pretty much anything, okay? I'm going to add about a tablespoon. I'm going to rub that in just like this. Rub it in. And now we're going to flip it over and season the other side the same way. like this and now I'm going to add in my Cajun crush this seasoning is so tasty like if you want your food to taste really really good any type of food use this seasoning okay it's so perfect and a lot of you guys have been you know supporting I want to say thank you for purchasing I have a new product coming on the website, so soon it'll be ready for you guys. I can't wait for you guys to, to try it. Now that the chicken is nicely seasoned, we're going to set it aside and move on to the next step. Moving on, we are getting ready to pin sear our chicken. I'm going to drizzle a little bit of oil, not too much. Like I said, if you cook chicken over rice before you know, if you don't, Pay attention, you might make it too greasy. So now I'm going to place my chicken right in, skin down first. Going to add the other one. The chicken looks really nicely marinated. I don't know about you guys, what's your thing? We're going to sear the chicken for about two minutes and then flip it over. We're not cooking it, it's going in the oven. We just want a nice, beautiful sear on it. So. I'm gonna wait for two minutes, then flip it over. The chicken is nicely ready to be flipped. It looks so good. Ooh, look how beautiful. I love using these nonstick pan. Oh my goodness, you guys. Do you see how beautiful the chicken is looking already? So we're gonna let it go maybe for one more minute. Then we'll take it out. Now it's time for me to take the chicken out. And let me tell you, it smells Amazing, okay? Amazing in here. So good. Oof. Yes, ma'am. There it is. Beautiful. In the same skillet, I am going in with some bell peppers, onion, celery. You can add whatever vegetable you want in here. Also, I have one tablespoon of minced garlic that I'm going to add in. Just cook that for a little bit until it starts to fragrance. I'm going to add in my rice so we can fry that with the veggies. Now I'm going to add the rice. I'm using two cups of rice. Make sure you wash the rice or rinse it. Now this is raw, okay? It's not cooked. I know a lot of you guys always ask, is it cooked rice? It is not cooked, it's raw. I just rinse it and now I'm adding it to my pot. 
give it a little mix. I'm going to lightly season the rice just a little bit. The chicken is going to add flavor to the rice, but lightly season the rice with some Cajun, Island Vibe Cajun Crush, and then give it a stir just like this. It's good to fry the rice. That helps it cook faster. And then we're going to add in our chicken broth, okay? So I'm using two cups of rice, four cups of chicken broth, okay? Add that in. Ooh, it smells so good. It smells absolutely delicious in here. Y'all don't know. Love, love, love that. Chicken over rice is my thing, y'all. It's so quick, so easy. One pot meal ready to go. So just add all of that in there. Give it a little mix. And now you're going to add in the chicken right on top. Just like this. Just like that. It smells so, 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 so good. Whatever's left, just pour that in. Now I'm going to place this in the oven on 350 for about 30 minutes. Now if you want, you can cook this on a stove top. It's still gonna be nicely cooked, okay? So I'm going to place it right in my oven. Let me see. Oh, yes. Now we wait. Now it's time to make the creamy sauce. I have a small skillet here. I am going to add a little bit of butter, about one tablespoon. Once that is nice and melted, I'm going to add a little bit of onion in here. Allow that to be nice and translucent. It's best to chop your onion smaller than, than this, okay? Once that is nice and translucent, I'm going in with some heavy cream. Just like this. This is about one fourth cup. Then we're going to season it with our Cajun Crush seasoning. About one tablespoon. Going to give that a quick mix. This sauce is extremely fast as you can see also we're going to add some parmesan cheese right in just like this make it nice and creamy perfect give it a quick stir oh yes it smells so good look how quick this sauce is pretty much done. Mm. Oh yes, this is what I'm talking about. This is amazing. Mm, mm, mm. All I need is a little bit of salt and we'll be good. Little tiny bit of salt and pretty much our sauce is ready. Look how thick and creamy this is what we want. Perfect. All right, guys, the rice is done and it smells so good. Oh my gosh, look at that. It looks so, so, so delicious, y'all. We're just going to pour that sauce right on top of the chicken. It's going to be amazing, okay? Let me plate it. If you serve somebody this plate of food, they will definitely appreciate you. Like this is giving restaurant quality, it's giving homemade at the same time, and it has the bell peppers, the onion, 
the protein and the carbs, of course. But let's not waste no time and dive in. It's looking real delicious right now. The creamy Cajun sauce is absolutely delicious. And this is how the chicken is looking. It's juicy, okay, it's juicy. So let's give it a try and see. Oh, that sauce is everything, okay? So, so, so good. My mouth is watering. I can't help it. Let's try it. This is delicious, okay? This is absolutely flavorful. Chicken is nicely cooked. The creamy sauce just, just make this dish 10 times better. This is a full course meal right there. Mm. Wow. This is good, I'm sorry. Mm, mm. Mm. Bomb.com. I have no words. All I can say, try this out. Guarantee you're going to enjoy this 1000%. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed today's recipe. Do not forget to give this video a thumbs up for me if you like it, if you find it helpful. Don't forget to subscribe here if you're new so you don't miss out on amazing recipes like this one. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you on the next delicious recipe. Bye guys.